Or resume? I just used to, um, I did 23 years in jail, so I only fucking spent about bloody, uh, I spent um, from 15 to bloody uh, 20 years old um, outside of jail, mm. except for uh, three months. And then I, I got locked up at the age of 20, and uh, oh, 19, 20, and I, I went away for three and a half years. And I started the Overcoat Gang while I was in jail. And we started the biggest gang war in Pentridge history. It lasted five fucking years. And, uh, and um, then when I got out, I, um, I attacked Judge William Martin in the county court with a sawed-off shotgun and demanded the release of my best friend, Jimmy Luppin, from Joe Woodhour Rat for the criminally insane. And I did nine and a half years over that and continued the gang war till 1980 until they built Jika Jika and I was the first prisoner to get put in Jika Jika. And um, I did three years in Jika Jika in the same cell in the same unit in Unit 2. And uh, I, I got out of there and went to Haste Division and, and recreated the, the gang war again, the Abercade gang again, and had another burst from 83 to fucking, um, no, from um, 80, 87, 88, to fucking um, 91. You know, so fucking it was the longest gang war in Pentridge history, mm. you know. And uh, I became fucking pretty well known in jail, you know, for cutting off my ears and getting stabbed and fucking stabbing other people and bashing other people and fucking, and all this stuff. We're constantly going to court for a, a, an attempted murder charges and shit, shit like that, you know, yeah. and assault charges. And, and, and I got out of jail and fucking, uh, I wrote a book in 1991, and I, and I got out of jail and it got published. It got published while I was out of jail in Tasmania. And uh, I lived down in Tasmania for about six and a half months and then, then fucking uh, got arrested for shooting the president of the Outlaw Motorcycle Club mm. in the back of my car. Mm. We took him to the hospital, convinced that he wasn't going to say anything. And he fucking, he couldn't keep his mouth shut when he got out of the fucking car. And uh, I, got, I did fucking uh, the Dangerous Criminals Act for that, never to be released. Mm. And I had to hire a, a, a lawyer who was a QC and a, and a member of parliament as well, um, Michael Hodgman, QC MP. And he, 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 had got, he got the law changed to take it out of the governor's hands and put it back into the hands of the, of the Supreme Court. So I went back to the Supreme Court and they lifted the Dangerous Criminals Act and gave me six years. But I did five years, nine months.